On this episode of Beer Time, we have the Voodoo Ranger Special Release Atomic Pumpkin. Coming in at a very strong 6.4 ABV, we have a pumpkin ale that actually includes peppers as well. Uh, reading the bottle, we have pumpkin ale featuring cinnamon and habanero chili peppers for just that right amount of heat. It's a very interesting beer, very clever bottle art, very similar to all the Voodoo Ranger um, line, though not to be confused, this is not an IPA. As you can see here, it's very, very light in color, very, very see-through. Here it is. Oh, that's good. That is really, really good. I know the beer sounds really off-putting. As, as we read earlier, we got cinnamon, habanero, and chili peppers, and like all kinds of different weird stuff in this. With pumpkin as the base flavor but it really could not work better. Um, this is probably the closest beer out there to tasting like an actual pumpkin pie. A good spicy fall pumpkin pie, and this is just ideal. Now, don't be off put by the habanero chilies and all that. Like there's a bit of heat to it, but it's this really minor afterburn that you get. There's just like minor soothing warmth on the finish of the beer. Uh, it's not spicy by any means. It is spiced in the sense of like a good earthy, wonderful pumpkin spice flavor with the hair of heat on the finish where you get a little bit of that, little bit of that heat and kick in the back of your throat. But it's very minor and it's actually really, really nice. Very different, really soothing and only adds and complements to the flavor of this beer that much further. Because boy, this one's good. And then there's tons and tons of great solid pumpkin and pumpkin spice flavoring. And that great warmth that the, the peppers add to the heat at the end of this, just to really complicate the beer further, um, give that much more to offer. You, you really can't go wrong with this one. Now it does come in the uh, six pack and it also comes in a variety pack of other new Belgian beers, which is the way I got a hold of it. Um, which the offering wasn't bad. It was like Fat Tiger Voodoo Ranger, um, this, and one of the other basic IPAs they have. I can't even remember. Uh, but you won't be disappointed with any of them. They're all good classics from New Belgium. With this wonderful special release, which I'm sure will not be around much longer, I'd say it's a must buy. I think if you see it, you have to grab it. It's too different, too fresh, and too exciting to pass up on. Definitely grab it. Like, if you see it, I would actually probably... I think there's a thing on New Belgium's website where you can actually figure out what stores close to you are offering what. I would actually probably go on there and figure out what store has this and pick it up because this is probably the best pairing beer you could have for Thanksgiving this year um, to offer the family for something fun and exciting for everybody. Um, so, with that said... Must buy. New Belgium never lets down. They really didn't with this one. I've actually been hunting this one down for like a month. Finally got it. You won't be disappointed if you buy it. Please do. And if you do, let me know what you think. Of course. Um, I might be overhyping it, but I think it's incredible. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time.